it's the most challenging. It's the hardest. I go! It's the most painful. One, two, three, ten. But it's the one that I appreciate the most. One, two, three, four. We like it here. We love it here. We found it, found it home. It's the one that I pride myself the most on. To per Alicia M. Sonderegger. Just after 1 p.m. Friday, October 19th, a moment Alicia Sonderegger literally and figuratively fought for, struggled and persevered, becoming a Michigan State Police Trooper. It was a 19-week process. What did I sign up for? <laughs> I was so nervous. Every aspect of the training curriculum is important, and you must achieve a level of proficiency in each one of them. Each one is a hurdle and an obstacle that each recruit must overcome. Right, face. The recruits are pushed to their physical limits here at the training academy, but Alicia says their emotions are tested as well. Some of the emotions she says she's experienced in her 19 weeks, frustration, anxiety, fear, and doubt. This academy specifically pushes you to the limit and then brings you back. If you don't doubt yourself at some point and fight through that, you didn't learn the lessons that you were probably intended to learn. And the lessons that must be learned and mastered are many. Some, though, fall into the category of fun, enjoyable. I did. I enjoyed the vehicle submersion. That was an eye-opening experience. And there were training exercises recruit Sonderegger would hope to soon forget. I don't ever want to remember what the pepper spray and the tear gas felt like, but I don't ever want to do it again. Do have a lock and check retention? Okay. All right, come on, turn around. <laughs> I need to remember what that felt like because it's very important training, but I, I would never want to experience that again. Each day for 19 weeks, a new experience, a new challenge, and one day closer to reaching a lifelong goal. My interest to become a police officer started very young. I was always kind of, you know, shadowing my dad at the police department, so there was always a commitment to public service. I can't wait to give that badge to my dad and have him pin it. That's who I am, that's who I represent.